my people. Now, wow, to become baby mama, don't become another title for Nigeria. It can't be like saying that the most trending job for Nigeria, now be that one. As David do baby mama, what did they call Sophia Momodu? He don't call David do come outside though. And according to Sophia, she said, financially bullying a woman into staying with you has got to be the most disgusting thing a man can do. Davido's baby mama, Sophia, now he writes that one. My people, the matter, he will escape. This one, so it can't be like saying, now every year, when he might the bet they don't the rich, now will they get some bad boss. But make one not forget, say, this the same Sophia. Now she come outside, come praise the video, say the video na one of the caring father when he don't see. Say even though their relationship don't lead to marriage, say thank God, say the daughter have a very wonderful father. That na one thing when the video, baby mama, admit some years ago. So when all this work on, they come now, not can understand where all this kind of talk they come from. But my own be say, in my own opinion, Honestly, left for me, oh, I can't judge anyone in this difficult situation because I love the both parties. Davido is a popular award-winning singer, married to Choma. He has four kids. Even though we don't know about an estranged one, but I mean that's okay. He has four baby mamas. On the other hand, Sophia is an entrepreneur and a businesswoman, according to her. But I have not seen her launch brands. If Sophia is a wise woman, all the money for upkeep, she will use it to build an empire for herself. She will convert it into different business and products that will bring more profits to her. But instead, she chose the baby girl's life, the baby mama's life, always getting from Imade's dad what he has for Imade. Do you understand now? Now, another thing you have to know, Apart from Davido, as we all know, that Kenya West is also a great dad. But for me, Davido is the best baby dad. We all know how he goes all round for his children, which we are aware of how he throws exotic parties. Because even Ellie didn't get any birthday party as usual. And on Monday is Imade's birthday. Rumor are speculating that Sophia called out Davido because he refused to throw Imade a party. I feel like not having a party this year won't kill anyone. I mean, the child should start learning that birthdays are not always for big parties. The mom can actually get a cake, gift, sponsor a little brooch or a date with the child's close friend, maybe 7 to 10 person. Then the widow or the other hand should get at least the child a gift. There is no need to come out call anyone out look at king toto dk today she's a single mother she's doing all well she's living her life she's making everyone know that with or without the father life goes on and there is something that has interests me that i also want to share with you while this message was circulating another person who i admire so much davido's sister she has come out to let Sophia know that you have to start working. You are a woman, not because you have a man who has a child with you and has money will stop you from working. Omo, I don't want to just say it so it won't look as if I'm the one saying it with my mouth. Let me drop what Davido's sister has come out to tell Sophia. On the other hand, then we get back again. Um, one of the things that I really just had to say concerning this is because I get a lot of people that come up to me and say, Sharon, why do you even work? Why do you even? And I'm just thinking to myself, so I went to school. I have a BSc. I have a master's degree and I have a brain, but I shouldn't do anything because my father is wealthy. You know, I went to school with British people primarily in my primary years. And I would go to school with high, you know, royal officials, kids. Um, I would go to school with, um, uh, what do you call it? Ambassadors, children, HRH children, um, millionaires and billionaires. And one thing was always common amongst all of them. They would never say they were rich. 
They'll be like, oh, I'm not rich. My father's rich. And honestly, I really adopted that mindset. And for me, I'm so happy that I did. And I'm so grateful because my dad spoils me to bits and I'm grateful. But I also understand that these are gifts. Do you understand? And I need to use these gifts well and manage my money well so that I too can provide for my children. You know, and I'm really happy that I'm an entrepreneur. I'm really happy that I don't work with my dad. Not that there's anything wrong with anyone working with their parents, but I just want the freedom to know that I can actually do it and I can push myself. I just feel like this, especially in Nigeria, I noticed my dad's rich, so I'm rich. If you don't know how they're making the money, if you're not actively in the business, I feel like it's very dangerous for you to develop that mindset. So when I come to you with all humility is because I have no choice but to be humble. Do you kind of get what I'm saying? I'm not raking in millions. I'm managing myself according to what I'm able to make for now. So I hope other people do the same, basically. Simply put, what she's trying to tell you is your father's money is not your money. Your baby's father, your baby's dad's money is not your money. You have to get your ass up and work and earn every cobble or every cent you make. And yet, another woman whom I respect, the ex-baby mama to Franklin, she also said something that makes a whole lot of sense. And I want to read what she said, so Sophia can also copy that. In her post, according to her, first of all, being a baby mama, does it mean you should be entitled to your baby's father's money? The only responsibility he has is towards your child and it's your responsibility to take care of your own child as well. It shouldn't be an avenue for you to make money or be taken care of. Now, if your baby father is dead beat, you can call him out with your full chest. If you can do it every AK market day, that will be awesome too. Financial abuse doesn't apply to baby mama, especially when the baby's daddy is present and doing what he should do for his own child, unless he stops taking care of his child. Most married women experience financial abuse from their spouse. It's like a scheme for them to stay in their useless marriage and have no means to live. If you are a baby mama and your baby daddy is taking care of your child, be grateful. But not taking care of you and you are ranting? Financial abuse? Madam, go and work and take care of yourself and your bills. I support women, but I don't support nonsense. Or more, this one, he ring bell. He not end for them. As he not direct the post to anybody. Now so the video on his own. For where he did je, 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 he just also drop his own reply. When we say, he tag and say he not they available. And according to the video, I no get time for Wahala. I day Ibiza. No vex. Then that he available moves, he come put him. Sophia on her own again, Consti go reply. Or more, the matter, he wear kokoshu. Let me they tell you. Sophia, before I go talk with her, she talk, according to rumor when speculates, she want the video to pay over 23 million house rent for Banana Island. Open a big shop for her. Alleged reason when make Sophia Momo do rant surface, now in be that one. On a no say, the online in-law, the Desabi decode way way. The Desabi go find things come aside. And then, Sophia call reply, don't dare. Or he must set it all on. Okay, now. Oh, now they set person all on, but this particular statement when Sophia do so, when say he won't set on fire, so hope not be herself she won't set on fire. Because the only thing when we say go cuckoo happen now for her to break internet, say ever since when we say she and David Do don't go their separate way, David Do still they knock him. And now I go come bring people go let her know say you day shameless because you never marry. David Do don't marry. He go make prospective in laws whether they won't look your way before. They go shele leave you because they know say brain in all day again. So my people, this now what it don't happen so far. And the person when they bring this news give you now the gossip headquarters. 
If now the first time when you come across this channel, I beg, make you hit the like button, subscribe, and make you turn on the post notification so that anytime when we drop gist like this, you go then notified and you go be the first to watch. I appreciate all your subscribers, all your time when you take the watch to all my returning subscribers. Now God, now I go reward all of honor. I go see you now again for our next video. Bye.